So welcome to this quick tutorial exploring the Zero Discord. We're using the Zero Discord to grow a global community. Discord is basically an online chat and kind of community management portal. Um, first of all, you'll be given a, an invite in various ways via a link from a PDF from the website or the QR code you can see here. Once you um, accept an invite, you can either download the app, um, it's available on just about all phones, or you can download the desktop app, which I will show you here. When you join, you will start off at the welcome page, which is this one, you'll appear in here, uh, and the first thing it asks you to do is head to the verify page and click the green tick. So you can see I've already verified myself, therefore it doesn't matter. We're using the verify just to allow um, the blocking of bots and spam accounts into Discord. Um, so the Discord is set up into various channels. You can see down the left here, um, you can expand them or close them depending on the roles that you get. Um, and the badges that are allocated depending on what your input is to the group. It allows you to diff it allows you access to different areas depend on permissions. Um, so for example, you see I've got access to the staff area. Uh, we have an info page which has um, all the introductions, websites, roadmap, um, etc, etc, and kind of information and server updates. The main area you will probably spend most of your time in Discord is within the chats. So we have global accounts, we have a leadership account, neck, uh, and the various regions. Um, just to keep things split up, but the majority of the chat is happening within uh, the zero global area. Uh, the, the main reason for the Discord so far is to basically manage the development of the working groups and the playbook. Um, but ultimately it works like a chat channel. So once you jump into a channel, you can message, you can at people, for example, like like most things, you, we have a large collection of custom GIFs uh, and to have a bit of fun. So it's quite kind of, it's, it's, it's a bit like a social media channel in a lot of ways. We have voice channels, so you can jump in and have chats with people. Um, we also have an events calendar so it shows all the events we have going on over the next come month and you can say whether you're interested and share them with your community. So you can see all of the conferences that we're going to be attending. Um, I've also got a rules page so it shows how, what to do uh, within the group and what not to do. But the whole thing is split up into channels. Uh, we have a supports page and we have a space where for our bots are managed because we do have bots and to-do lists. Um, but it's fairly simple. You can open and close the different channels, whether you want to be involved with them, and that's basically how it works. You can see who's online. Um, you can send direct messages like more social media channels. But this is just a quick introduction to show you how it works. If you have any questions, please do let um, either any of the, the core staff or the moderators know, which you can see on the right here, and just send them a direct question or ask directly in the Discord. Thank you.